What's going on guys? Today, let's go over the breakneck Minecraft mod pack and how to improve your server. In Minecraft 1.20, some players might be looking to change a few aspects of the game, and with Breakneck, you can do just that. This fabric mod is completely client-sided, meaning you can join almost any server with the enhanced gameplay it offers. You'll receive an FPS boost and have the ability to use built-in shaders, along with several other features, so let's go over how to install it. Before getting started with the mod pack, you're going to want to install the CurseForge launcher. Head to CurseForge and press download for your operating system, and then save and open this file on your computer to start the installation process. After that's done, start up the launcher and click Browse Mod Packs from the menu, and then type Breakneck in the text box and select it once it's found. Now you can click Versions and press the Download button for any 1.20 instance. Wait for everything to finish installing, then you can click Play from My Mod Packs to load it. In future updates for Breakneck, the latest releases might be Minecraft 1.20 or higher. This means you can simply press install once it appears after searching for the mod pack in CurseForge, or you can use the versions list to find a specific one. When you load into the Minecraft world, you're going to notice that your frames per second have greatly increased. This can be amplified by tweaking extra settings and fine tuning everything to suit your needs. One of the first activities you'll want to do is enabling some resource packs in-game. By default, there are already some activated with a few leftovers. In some cases, these resource packs might be outdated, but this shouldn't be too big of an issue since it tends to be compatible regardless of the Minecraft version. If you're wanting more packs to enjoy, you are able to do that in the CurseForge profile for Breakneck, where you can add your own. Additionally, there are shaders available to use with the mod pack. This can be accessed through the video settings, which reveals two options to try out. One of these is more for quality, while the other is built with performance in mind, and there will be subtle differences in between the two. Installing your own is also possible if it's compatible with the mod pack. One of the resource packs includes custom and unique animations for mobs, NPCs, and other entities. For example, villagers now appear to be more lifelike, and the same applies to chickens, zombies, cows, spiders, and many other creatures. Similar concepts also apply to eating food or other interactions. Throughout the video, we've mentioned that Breakneck significantly improves the performance of Minecraft. This isn't an understatement, as players can completely max out their graphics, resource packs, shaders, and more while still retaining over 200 frames per second. In some cases, this can reach well over that number, but that depends on your machine and in-game events. This is amplified without having shaders or extra settings, providing some machines with over 500. Achieving a high number of frames per second involves you tweaking settings such as the render distance, max frame rate, and other options. This is achieved by the Sodium video settings, providing a detailed menu of everything that you can edit. Another unique feature from this mod pack is a new GUI menu called Operator Utilities. This is enabled through the controls category in the settings, allowing you to access custom items only with OP levels. For example, you can grab barriers or lighting blocks to help build the perfect structure. Whether you're in a modded or a plugin based server, this is going to come in handy when building. And there are even four new paintings for you to enjoy, adding on to the personalization of your base. Now, before we get into the common issues, don't forget to like, subscribe, and click that notification bell to stay up to date on all future videos. In some cases, the game might crash due to ongoing issues with the mod pack version you installed. If available, we suggest switching to another build of Breakneck. This might help prevent crashes from happening, but you can also contact our support for any additional help. The cause might be related to something completely different, so make sure to note what occurs before the issue starts. If you're experiencing in-game lag on your server, it might be caused by other reasons instead of the mod pack being the main factor. You can always take a look at our optimization guide to try out some of these solutions. Besides this, a general note to make is avoiding too many entities or events in-game. However, if you lag in a brand new world, then this could indicate that you need to allocate more memory to the CurseForge launcher. With the Breakneck mod pack, your Minecraft experience is greatly enhanced and improved. 
There are over 100 mods, all of which help make the game perform better. Whether you're taking advantage of the new settings or simply wanting an optimized version of your beloved game, this mod pack is absolutely worth the try. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more great content like this, then subscribe or click these videos. Until next time, gamers.